Hi, welcome to the Online Jewelry Academy. I'm Professor John R. and I'm your instructor. Now, I've gotten a lot of email from you guys asking me questions primarily about simple storage and bench setup. Now, I know that a number of you are just beginners and you're trying to do this on a budget. So, in keeping with that, I'm trying to develop simple solutions for you guys that you can easily afford and that will make your bench operation fantastic. Now, in a previous video, I showed you how to make this. It's a really simple rack that can be used on either the side of your bench or on the table that will hang either hammers like I've got here or files or any other tool that you wanted to hang off the bench. This is great because you can make it for almost nothing and it keeps your tools at the ready. Well, I want to show you something along the same lines that's really inexpensive and just totally improves your performance at your bench. And what I'm talking about are these right here. It's a Lazy Susan. Now, you can get this at your local hardware store for about $4. Now, this is a four inch Lazy Susan fitting and you can see that it swivels. Now, what I've done with this one is I've equipped it with pads that are half of a Velcro attachment. And on the back surface of my insulated kiln shelf that I solder on top of, I've placed the other pieces of the Velcro. So all I have to do is just slap that on. And now I have a surface that will spin. Now you're probably asking yourself, why do you want that? Let me show you. If I put my charcoal block on top of it, and from another previous video, I showed you how you could use bandsaw blade segments to create risers to raise up your project. So let's just put a piece of copper right there to simulate your project. What I can do is I can now take my torch and hold it so that I focus the flame below my piece and I can just turn the piece without having to move the torch around. Okay, so another way that you could use the same idea is right here. What I've done is I've taken a bunt pan for baking bunt cakes and I added a Lazy Susan to the bottom of it. And this is great because this is essentially plastic and it can go into the oven so it withstands high temperatures and if it fell on the floor, it's probably not gonna break. So what this turns into now is a great storage caddy. So if you take some rocks, and I'm just gonna drop some rocks into the bottom, that stabilizes it. And now what I can do is I can just move in. I can put in my pliers, my torch, here's a soldering pick, I could put my safety glasses, a pen, some flux, you get the idea. Everything now is at my disposal. And I made this for maybe about six bucks. I hope these ideas keep you working and productive. Check out our other videos on our playlist at www.onlinejewelryacademy.com. You can also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Thanks for watching.